You can see it growing on the walls and ceiling. It's mold. And in some rooms, it's everywhere. When I walked into the room, I noticed the wet, musty smell. It was discovered a week and a half ago in the inn at Hawking College. Tests were done and it was found in several rooms. The inn, which is used as a hands-on classroom for hotel management students, closed all 42 guest rooms and guest reservations canceled. It is a common mold. It is uh, a mold which is not dangerous. Uh, it's usually um, exacerbated by the humid, we humid weather that occurs in our valley. And this summer has been exceptionally humid, so we're experiencing a bit more of that than we might have otherwise. And so much more in one of their residence halls. Hocking Heights tested high for mold as well. Fortunately, there aren't any students living there for summer term, so the dorm is closed for now until it's clean inside and out. When I checked by, crews were checking all the rooms. So how could this mold problem grow so big so fast? We would believe that it is probably related to ventilation and the HVAC in the building. In fact, experts at the Athens County Health Department I spoke to today say that mold can grow like this in just one week, given the right conditions. So the dorm will be cleaned and the inn is being closed for now with anticipation of some sort of remediation, but also a remodeling project. Hawking College says the dorm will be ready for students in late September. We'll keep you posted. In Nelsonville, Steve Wayne for NBC4.